Now we have a game Paper Boy, uh, which has a bug with the default emulator we use. Uh, we can simply fix the issue by changing the default uh, emulator core. So press A to get into the game and keep pressing A, keep pressing A. So when you see the loading screen, okay, uh, it will bring up a uh, launch menu and from here we can see the default emulator for NES is LR Quick NES, which is the one that has bug. It doesn't uh, support input uh, in the Paperboy game. So we we, we go to the item two, number two, select emulator for ROM. So from here, we change it to uh, one or two, either one. Either one will work, you know, I, I already tested it. So uh, I will use Nastopia, which is said to be like a, uh, a good balance between, uh, between speed uh, and uh, the accuracy. Okay, number two. Uh, Nastopia, select OK. Uh, make sure that you don't change the default emulator. You know, leave it to uh, Quick NES because it, 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 it is of the uh, greatest uh, performance. And it, it works for like almost all the games. So we just changed the default emulator for ROM to uh, Nastopia. And then we launch the game. Okay, the controller works. Okay, it works like a charm. Ah, uh, that's that's all for it. Next time you get into Paperboy, it will use the the, the good emulator for it, and all the other games. It will keep use the it will keep using the default quick NES. Thank you.